This is how to split your audio in Streamlabs OBS. So what you will be using is when you click on plus to add sources, application audio capture, then just add source. And now you want to name it to, for example, the game you're going to be playing. Roblox audio, for example, and then add source. And now where it says window, you're going to click that and you want to make sure that Roblox is running in the background and then you can just click it. And now we have it right here. So after that, we're going to add as many sources as we want. I will add another one. Click on this, add a new source instead. For example, music. And then click here. And I will find where my music is playing right here. And there we go. Now what we're going to do is mute desktop audio or whatever default audio you have here. So now in this audio mixer, I have my mic, the music that is playing and the game sound. So if I go to the settings in the bottom left, then go to output and click on simple and click on advanced. Now for streaming, there's always going to be one audio track. So this applies to recording, go to recording and then right here where it says audio track. Now we have three separate audio sources that we want to incorporate into one file. So because number one is assigned to uh, streaming, we're going to uncheck number one and check two, three and four. And there we go. Just click done. And then after that, you just have to in the mixer assign each audio source to a number. So click on the cogwheel right here. And there we go. You can now see all the tracks. So this is muted and we can uncheck this. We won't be using any desktop audio. And this, when we select number one, will go through into the stream. And now, for example, we want the mic to be track two and then music track three and then Roblox audio track four. And now you have the audio split into three tracks. And I will also show you one neat trick. For example, let's say you recorded something and you want to remove one track out of the video that you recorded, but you don't want to, but you don't want to re-encode the whole video, which takes a lot of time, especially if you're recording gameplay footage and it's gigabytes of data. There is this neat little program called AVI Demux. Search for it online and you should find it. And this is how it looks. And to use it, you can just click right here to import something and find your file that you want to delete the audio track from. And now when you've opened the file, just navigate to the audio tab in the top left and click select track. And right here you can see I have three tracks. And then I can just uncheck two tracks. Maybe I just want the track one or maybe I want the track two and then click OK. And then you can go file, save, and then save this file and it's going to be only the track you selected without re-encoding the whole file. Hopefully this helps you.